Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Awesome, glad you're here. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Hey, if you haven't subscribed yet, uh, go ahead and subscribe if you want, if you've been hanging around. You know, like I always say, you know, if, you, if you've been coming back, uh, by all means, you know, join join us here. It just helps me out a little bit more than it helps you out. But uh, if you subscribe, you can press the notification bell and then press the, you know, all button or whatever, then you could get, you know, obviously, um, these episodes into your notification box so that helps you out if you think that's a help <laughs> if you think that's a help uh, so we'd be helping each other out you know helping each other out and make sure you like the video too if you're here for the song like it for the song you know regardless of what I say if I say something stupid because I don't know or I say something uh, funny or offensive what if I'm offensive oh man Okay, anyways, Epica, and this is Beyond the Matrix. Uh, I love the Matrix, so I wanted to see, uh, I, I got to see that new stuff, the new Matrix, just to chase a squirrel for a second. But uh, Beyond the Matrix, this is a live at the Zenith official video, so that is cool. I like watching them live. So let's check it out. It's six minutes and 48 seconds. Are you ready? I am. To jump. To jump? Beyond. The Matrix. Mm.
much. The most beautiful show of this tour. Cool. It's been a while. Been a while. That was really a great performance. Um, you know, it's not my favorite style of music, um, but I don't find anything object objectable, objectable about it. I do not object. So maybe that's not even a good way to put it at all. Uh, it, I like it. It's really good. So um, it's amazing. It's, in fact, it's amazing. Um, and I and I am very entertained by it. I must say, uh, for it not being my best, my favorite kind of music, I'm really entertained by it, especially watching it live. Uh, it's it's a kind of a new genre for me. Uh, within the last like three months or so, and I've listened to different different bands in the genre and many songs, half a dozen maybe of Epica, and uh, the talent is undeniable, you know, and it's something that is actually growing on me quite a bit i must say um uh, i really feel and felt very like uh foreign to me you know i'm talking about epica and say nightwish and uh, and some of the others um that are kind of in that sort of genre that i've recently been playing in over the last few months very foreign to me i didn't have any experience with it whatsoever. So um, I really have come to appreciate it so much more. It seems like uh, now when I come back to it, you know, I, I there's a familiarity of, to it now. And, and I recognize people that I had no idea existed, you know, and I'm starting to recognize them. So it makes it funner for me, too. So that really enhances my listening experience. And that was great. I was just really swept up into not only the song, but the performers and their performances. Uh, just watching uh, the camera work and, and just going shooting from one place to another and one person to another. It's just really fascinating to see these guys play this kind of music. It's so powerful and it's so precise and it's so energetic and yet... Um, it's got a lot of emotion and movement into it, and her vocal is, is just absolutely amazing. Of course, very that particular song sounded quite operatic uh, style of singing, um, but uh, it was really really good. Uh, the whole thing was, and the, and her singing vocally, she was great. Her singing vocally, because some people, you know, don't sing vocally. They they use their their nostril. I've seen it. I've seen that done. It's bizarre. You, you don't want. To, I won't go any further detail on it. But anyways, um, she doesn't do that that I'm aware of. At least I haven't heard it yet. So uh, great, great song. I loved it, and definitely a genre that is growing on me uh, by leaps and bounds. For for, for sure, for sure. Uh, it's fun to hear all this new music and just be exposed to it. That's just part of the fun. Uh, really, I feel like really, uh, I feel, I don't know, a lot of energy behind it. A lot of, it feels complete. It feels like, uh, it feels like I'm learning, you know, like I'm back in college or something, you know, where you're really uh, having to focus and uh, learn some new things and it just fires the synapses and stuff like that. So uh, that's why um, my forehead's gotten so big lately. It's not because I'm losing hair. Yeah, no, my, my hairline is not receding. It's the synapses firing. I'm just making more space. 